Well, here we are getting some last stitch efforts from Mother Nature to, for us to remember what summer feels like. Yes, because believe it or not, Dave, we are starting fall officially on Saturday, but man, has it, it been hot. It does not feel like fall is on the way anytime I, soon. It, it, I mean, we're going to get a shock to our systems come Friday. So give it another 48 hours. Let me know how, how you feel. But as you are getting up on this Wednesday morning at 617, we are starting off on a clear but very humid note for us here in Northwest Missouri and Northeast Kansas. Now I have seen mostly clear skies throughout the morning hours on our KQ2 tower camera overlooking the beautiful city lights of St. Joseph. But again, get ready. It's going to be another hot and muggy day ahead for us. Right now, temperatures in St. Joseph are sitting at 70 degrees, but this is what's been getting my attention, the dew point. I always explain the dew point is the amount of moisture we have in our atmosphere. It's at 70 degrees, so it's making it very humid out there this morning as we are sitting with the humidity at exactly 100% with calm winds. Now with the air temperature, the dew point meeting up with the humidity at 100% of the calm winds, that's usually the right ingredients for some fog or some light patching fog to form. As of right now, I have not gotten any reports of low visibilities or some fog or mist developing this morning, but of course I'll keep you updated on that. Pressure is holding steady at 29.9 inches as you're stepping out the door it is definitely a muggy and warm start with temperatures sitting in the lower 70s for the most part places like Hiawatha Fall City Trenton you're sitting in the upper 60s right now don't get too comfortable with these temperatures because guess what they're just going to continue to warm up thanks to that southeasterly flow of the winds we're going to get today. Right now, we are going to be dealing with temperatures at 74 degrees as you start off the work and school day. As you head home, temperatures are going to be sitting at 92 degrees. A reminder, the St. Joseph School District is going to be letting out two hours early middle school and high school because of how oppressive the heat is going to feel as you head home from work and school. Now. I'm expecting temperatures to go up to 93 degrees today for our high. That could near the record high of 96 that was set back in 1931 for September 19th. Now, yesterday we topped out at 97, which almost tied the record of 98 set back in 1925. So I would not be surprised if we get close to this record high temperature today. But it's not the air temperatures I want you to focus on. I want you to focus on the heat index. Pay attention to how our hour by hour forecast is playing this out. As you're heading out to the lunchtime hour, it's already going to feel like 94 degrees out there. And then as we go into the afternoon by around 3 o'clock, it's going to feel like 98 upper 90s for the most part across northwest Missouri and northeast Kansas. So it is definitely going to be a late hot summer day. So it's just very important that you just take it easy out there if you're going to be working outside or have any outdoor plans. Again, just Dress properly for summer with that light colored, lightweight clothing. Of course, drink plenty of water. Have the sunscreen handy if you have to be out in the sun. And of course, make sure you have a good place to go with air conditioning. Now, the good news is we do have relief on the way as we are going to be going from 92 degrees tomorrow for your Thursday back down into the 70s heading into Friday and into the weekend near our average high of 78 degrees as a strong cold front is going to be pushing through finally cooling us back down to those near normal temperatures. We are sitting to mostly clear skies as well in our KQ2 Tri-State 4 camera. Nothing much going on across the KQ2 viewing area on our KQ2 satellite and radar, but I am paying attention to all this activity in the northern plains. That is our strong cold front low pressure system. That's going to be responsible for giving us those rain chances as we go into the next 48 hours. So keep it tuned to KQ2. 93 degrees today for your high hot, humid, a little bit breezy with those south winds at 5 to 15 miles per hour. Overnight low tonight going down to 72 degrees. And then look at this, Jane. Finally, rain chances move back in. 60% chances late Thursday into Friday, cooling us back down as we welcome fall on Saturday. As we're going to be a little bit cooler, 72 degrees by Saturday, but we'll be back up to near normal by Sunday. Near normal. Makes me nervous, but I think it'd be nice to have a break from this oh, really hot heat. Thanks, Vanessa. Well, there